Britain's qualification hopes are hanging by a thread as they take on Indonesia in their final match of Group A in the Abdullah bin Khalifa Stadium. A stalemate against Australia in their opener followed by a last-minute loss against Qatar means it's a must-win match for Jordan. Head coach Abdullah Abu Zema knows they'll have to be more clinical against the well-organised Indonesia. Goal scorer Aref El Hash starts in midfield. Indonesia in the under-23s Asian Cup for the first time took down Australia 1-0 with a battling display in their last match. They'll qualify for the next round with a win today. Shin Tai Yong can call on Eva Jenner as he returns after his sending off in the opening game. Straight away, a lively start, frantic from the first whistle. Indonesia coming forward to take it to the byline and it's cut back to Raffle Struck. The goalkeeper stands up tall to tip it over the bar. A good save, but it's a warning shot for Jordan. A high energy start continues in the ninth minute at the other end. Jordan coming forward, a lovely through ball to Arif al Haj, bearing down a goal. The goalkeeper, Anando Ari, is quickly off his line to snuff out the danger. Really good goalkeeping there. Probing for the opening. Almost found it. Back at the other end. Indonesia with some slick passing into the penalty area. Raffel Struck picks it up and he's brought down. There's a tangle of feet and it's Amar Jamas who's clipped the attacker. And it's a penalty and a massive opportunity for Marcelino Ferdinand to open the scoring, which he does, tucking it away into the left-hand corner. Smartly struck from the rising star, and Indonesia have the advantage in this must-win match. More slick passing, and they're through here, and Witan bends it into that far corner. It's a scintillating move. It's football of the highest quality, as Indonesia cut Jordan's defence apart with a sweeping move. Marcelino to Rizky Rido, and Witan is there. Into the 70th minute, we jump forward. The second half, Indonesia come again. Marcelino tucks it past the goalkeeper to make it 3-0. It's the deftest of touches, and surely that books Indonesia's passage into the knockout rounds. Lovely one-two, gets it back, and then props it past the goalkeeper. Jordan trying to stage the most unlikely of comebacks. On the front foot here, ball slips through, but the goalkeeper's there to palm it away. Stood up tall. And they've had to absorb a little bit of pressure as Jordan try and find a way back into this game. They come again in the 79th minute. Shot comes in, it's heavily deflected and it's into the back of the net. Justin Hoopner, unlucky defender, scores an own goal, heavily deflected after Wazim Al Rialat had taken the shot. And Jordan come again just minutes later. Ali Aziza picks it up. Driving into the penalty area, tries to squeeze it in at the near post, but Anando Ari stands up tall once again. Great save from the goalkeeper. Indonesia now finishing strongly. Pratama Ahan to launch this throw in into the penalty area, and it's nodded on and it's in. Kumang is there to guide it past the goalkeeper to make it 4 1 to Indonesia. And congratulations to them as they brushed off a disappointing debut opening game against Qatar to claim back to back wins against Australia and now Jordan. They're through to the knockout rounds, finishing on six points. And it's disappointment for Jordan, who are outplayed by some slick passing moves today. And they struggle to get a foothold in the group and finish behind Australia.